Clean up brush. Multiples of 10 in this video. So we already know a good deal about multiplying by 10. For example, for example, this is 10 blocks. We already know a great deal about multiplying by 10. If we have two of these, for example, 10 times two, that's 20. 10, we already know about multiplying by 10. So for example, if we have two times 10, that's 20. Hey, what's going on here? Three tens, three times 10 would be 30. So what we're starting to see here is a shortcut. For example, if we have four tens, it's so messy here. If we have four tens, that's gonna be 40. So we're starting to see a shortcut. Four tens, hmm, 40. That means four, and then you just add the zero, 40. All right, let's talk about multiplying avocados. First, we're gonna establish that we have 10 avocados. Two, four, six, eight, 10. And then we're going to multiply by 10. 48 times 10, what in the world? Banana, no. 48 times 10 is not banana. Get out of here, banana. We wanna know what 48 tens are. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you the answer. It's 480. Now there's a shortcut here that we're going to learn where you can just attach the zero to 48. But let's illustrate this. We have 48 tens. Each of these columns of avocados have 10 avocados and we have 48 of these columns. So we count 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, and we keep counting and we'll get 480 avocados. That's right class, 48 by 10 is 480. That is to say, 48 tens is 480. That's why, banana, get out of here. Come on, move. 48 tens is 480. So the shortcut is we just attach the zero to the 48 and boom, Bob's your uncle. We get 480. Two, three. I've got 30 friends, they want two pizzas each. 30 by 2 is 60 pizzas, that's a lot of pizzas for me and you and you and you you. I've gotta get pizzas with extra cheese, anchovies, ooh. I've got 40 friends, they want three pizzas each. 40 by 3 is 120 pizzas for me and you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and you. I need pizzas with pepperoni, ham and pineapple, yummy. I've got 40 friends, they want 5 pizzas each. 40 by 5 is 200 pizzas, that's a lot of pizzas for me, and you, and you, and you, you. You, you? All right, gang, let's do multiples of 10. So far, I've got too many blocks out here, but each of these represents 10 blocks. 10, four, six, eight, 10. And I want to do multiples of 10. So one 10 is just 10. Two 10s, now that, that's something special. Two 10s represents 20. No thank you, Greater Gator. No, thank you. Three tens. That represents. Greater Gator in the box. Hey, Greater Gator. Three tens represents 30. Four tens represents 40. Four times 10, 40. Five tens represents 50. Five times 10 is 50. What about six tens? Six tens represent 60. Six times 10 is 60.
Now seven tens. That's seven times ten. Oh, that's seventy. <laughs> and eight tens. Eighty. Eight times ten is eighty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Are you seeing a pattern here? Eight tens is eighty because it's eight times ten. It's like we're just adding a zero to the end of eight. Hmm. Nine tens. Nine times ten is ninety. Now we have nine times ten or ninety. We have ten tens. One hundred. Ten times ten is one hundred. We took a ten and we multiplied it by ten. We have ten tens, so that's one hundred. We just added a zero to the end of ten. Wow! Okay, how about a bonus here? Eleven tens. That makes it one hundred and ten. Eleven tens, one hundred and ten. Again, I see this pattern here. I hope you do too. We're just adding a zero at the end of eleven when we do eleven times ten, and we get one hundred and ten. Likewise, twelve tens. That's one hundred twenty. 120. Hey, I, I heard Pirate Sam. That's right, Pirate Sam. Well, Pirate Sam, we're not doing subtraction. Please excuse us. We're doing multiplication. That's okay. I like multiplication too. Yar, har, 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 har. Well, Pirate Sam, if you're going to keep talking about multiplication, you might as well make a cameo here. Yar, har, har, har. All right, Pirate Sam. Enough of that. You're just being silly. We're talking about multiplication. We have 13 tens here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13 tens. That's 130. We're adding a zero to the end of 13. That's the shortcut. 130. 13 times 10. Now, hey, what's going on here, Snowplow? Get out of here. Hey, there's ice cream. I don't want you to miss any of our content. You gotta subscribe, and you really should join the newsletter. That's gonna be the way that we transform the landscape for math education, not just for your youngster, but for classes around the world. We're gonna start off here, and we'll grow and expand and reach kids elsewhere, because everybody needs to learn how to solve problems, and they need math education that is tailored to their rate of learning. We can do that together. Join me, join the newsletter. See you next time, God bless. Pirate Sam, what are you doing back here? Okay, Pirate Sam. Back to multiplication. What if we want to do, oh, 30 tens? Could that just be 300 because we're adding a zero to the end of 30? Let's take a look. <gasps> That's right. We have now tripled 100. We have 30 tens. 30 times 10 makes it 300. What if we quadruple 100? 400. 40 tens. 40 times 10 is 400. Look at that. 40 times 10 is 400. We're adding a zero to the... Harvard Sam. There's the greater gator. He's eating the tens. What is going on here? All chaos is breaking out on the math set. Hey, what's going on here? Hey, don't eat the tens. And go for it, snowplow. Oh, snap. Here comes Okay, the let's review another problem where we multiply by 10. We start with 10 avocados again, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 avocados. And then we multiply by 56. It's not a bunch of bananas. Get out of here, bananas. What in the world is going on here? One banana was bad enough. Now we have a bunch. We're trying to figure out what is 56 times 10. Or in other words, What's 56 tens? Oh, we don't know. So let's count our avocados. We have 56 columns, and in each column, we have 10 avocados. That is a lot of avocados. 10, 20, 30 avocados, 40, 50 avocados, 60, all the way to 560. That's right, class. If we keep counting, we will get that 56 times 10 is 560. Now that is to say 56 tens is 560. So the shortcut is we are just attaching the zero to 56 and that's how we get 560 when we multiply 
by 10. I want to share it with my friends. <laughs> Cut a card in it and add your beers now. Ew, that's so painful. Do, 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 do,